And now for a real storm. conditions continued to deteriorate. By 11 a.m. we were experiencing sea state 9, which is the sea state designation for phenomenal seas, with waves in excess of 45 feet, occasionally reaching heights of 60 and 70 feet. We were also experiencing violent storm winds, force 11, occasionally gusting to force 12, hurricane force. Since we were pointed into the heavy seas, big waves were coming over the bow sheaves on a regular basis. Finally, at 11.20 a.m., a massive wave came crashing onto the foredeck, flooding out the cable drum compartment and knocking out the forward gill thruster.
We were now entering a critical and dangerous situation. At 11.40 a.m., the order was given to cut the ground rope and also the cable which had been in place for a later bow to stern transfer. Shortly thereafter, a sharp uh, wind gust knocked the ship off its heading. Since we now lacked full power, we were unable to regain our heading, thereby forcing Captain Murrett to execute an emergency turn in dangerous uh, sea conditions. During this 20-minute emergency turn, we experienced heavy rolling with an estimated max roll of 47 degrees. It was indeed a nerve-wracking time, especially for those non-mariners amongst us, as borne out by the tension evident in the live commentary. undergoing some heavy rolling as we try to come around in the face of this storm. We just uh, cut the rope, we're trying to bring the ship around. However, one of our thrusters is flooded, so we don't have full power right now. And uh, hopefully you can see the severe rolling through the windows. Well, you can hear it as we move around the bridge here. Very, very dangerous situation at the moment. Our compartment is flooded at the moment, uh, we don't have uh, full power. So, hopefully, through the window, you can see the horizon in the distance. But we are undergoing very severe and dangerous rolling at this point. endeavoring to uh, get the ship around so that we can uh, get away from this uh, severe rest storm. Situation. <laughs> well, 
Well, Captain Murray has finally managed to uh, bring the ship around, and uh, the situation is now stabilized uh, to some extent. Uh, we're now in the best particular heading we can have in this uh, very uh, dangerous uh, sea condition that prevails. Uh, one of the starboard buoys has come adrift, uh, so uh, some crew men will try to uh, secure it uh, on the fore deck. Obviously, uh, a very dangerous uh, situation also under the prevailing uh, weather conditions. In the end, it became possible to lay some cable because the weather improved. In fact, it almost got fine.